Today's webinar is titled Automate Employee Safety with Apple Device Management. You'll hear from both Jamf and True Software about how our partnership can really truly help elevate employee safety, whether they're behind the wheel, around heavy equipment, or even in specific designated zones so that the technology that you empower your team with is not a distraction and therefore causing avoidable accidents throughout the workday. My name is Danny Porter. I'm a partner development manager here at Jamf. I get to work with our uh, integration partners that have unique workflows in specific industries to support you uh, and other customers and, and uh, other companies in the market in order to solve real problems um, with real solutions. Pete Plotus will be joining us later on. Uh, he's the VP of Global Alliances and Strategic Development at Truce Software. He'll be taking some time to share more about the Truce platform and how you can utilize that within the context of your organization. Throughout our time, we'll kind of maybe lay out a little bit of an agenda specifically about what is worker safety? How have we defined that together so that that might be applicable to your organization and your employees? We'll talk about the Jamf platform and how this lays the foundation for device management to empower and take advantage of the tools that True Software provides with context. We'll talk about True Software and our partnership together. And then throughout our conversation today, uh, we're going to highlight one of our joint customers, Preventive Pest Control out of Tennessee. They're currently using Jamf and Truce together. They've integrated our products uh, in order to automate employee safety for their field service technicians when they get behind the wheel of their trucks. So we'll talk about that throughout our conversation. For those of you who are new to Jamf, um, we're passionate about helping organizations succeed with Apple. We are uh, focused on the Apple platform from Mac to iPads, iPhones, Apple TVs, anything that Apple allows us to help manage, we're here to support you. Supporting with identity using products like Jamf Connect, Jamf Protect around security, and then our management portfolio of Jamf Now for our small to medium businesses, Jamf Pro for that IT professional, and Jamf School for those that are needing an education specific workflow that supports and empowers educators. Of course, underlying all of this is Jamf Nation. It's a community of Apple admins uh, that span the entire world. If you have questions about Apple devices or deployment strategies, or hey, you just have a question, feel free to reach out to free community uh, in order to help you be successful. We support, as I mentioned, across the entire Apple enterprise platform, from making sure devices are set up and deployed and secured fresh out of the box, to ongoing management for your IT uh, team in order to make sure that the devices stay uh, equipped and, and tooled and, and ready to go for your employees. Today, we're going to talk a little bit more about on the far right, our APIs and marketplace integrations. But don't worry, I'm not that technically smart, so I'm not going to talk about APIs. Uh, and if you don't know what that acronym is, don't worry. Um, because honestly, I actually don't know what that acronym is either. Um, but we're here to talk more about how does our marketplace help extend the power of mobile device management? Jamf has been around since 2002, and we've got to really support organizations for almost these last 20 years, really expanding among over 50,000 organizations and managing almost uh, just over 21.8 million Apple devices. And we get to do some fun projects with companies, as you see here, uh, the top 10 US banks and top tech companies and uh, largest global, most valuable brands. But the thing that we're so excited about is that whether you're large or you're the local coffee shop or you have a fleet of 10 devices or you have a fleet of 100 drivers or 1,000, we're here to help you be successful with the technology so that technology doesn't get in the way. 
And I think this really kind of teed us up as an organization as we began to talk with Apple and other industry leaders around how can we help solve a problem that could be caused by technology. And that was the birth or the foundation of what we talk about today in worker safety. Now we talked about this uh, webinar as employee safety, worker safety, employee safety, really trying to help organizations uh, fit into their uh, safe driving use policy. How do we make sure that drivers and employees are safe in whatever context they're in? Because the reality is we know that technology can cause distractions throughout the workplace. And unfortunately, that can be um, some fatal as well. We know that about 20% of fatally injured workers in 2019 was a mobile sales worker or a truck driver. Now, when we think about mobile sales worker, think about the deskless workforce. So that could be a salesperson even that needs to drive around and, and visit your clients and your customers. That could be a service technician. I just had uh, some plumbers come by my house just yesterday. Um, yeah, we can talk about that story another time. But you know your team. Maybe they're working in a warehouse or in a, a manufacturing plant or uh, they're delivering um, other tools, lumber, utility workers, going from site to site, needing to uh, be mobile always. That's what we think about. And even in the last, the first 11 months of 2020, industry leaders saw that there was a 63% increase in collision per million miles. That even now, more than ever, driver safety is at a severe risk. We know that nearly 40% of workplace-related fatalities involved transportation incidents. And in the construction industry, one in five worker deaths was in construction. So we really want to help organizations be successful with Apple and to help workers be safe throughout their workplace and throughout their shift. We want to help workers get home safely in the same way that they came to work that day. And we know that you do too, because you have different safety policies that you've put in place in order to keep your workers safe. So now that we've painted that picture, let's talk a little bit about the actual solution. As we talk about JAMP today, we'll kind of think about it in this three-tiered effect. First and foremost, mobile device management. Now, most of you here probably have a mobile device management tool that you use that gets the apps where they need to be, software updates, and other restrictions that you might want to apply. We'll build upon that, upon a, an app that Jamf has developed called Jamf Setup and Jamf Reset that helps create the right behaviors um, behind your workflows and your team. And then for those of you that are in a very high-risk environment or just want to automate safety, We'll highlight Truce and our integration between Truce and Jamf Pro in order to keep your workers safe. So where do we start? We start at the beginning. We start at that foundation. For those of you who don't know, Mobile Device Management, or MDM, is simply the framework that Apple has built in order to help organizations be successful with using Apple in their organization, in their environment. That can be from the first time you open up the phone or open up the iPad and take it out of the box. It could be inventory management, other restrictions, or other applications that you might use for dispatch, maps, or other tools for work orders, etc. And underlaying, of course, under that is security. We want to make sure that your corporate data is secure. Where are those devices going? What happens if they get left or stolen? How do we make sure that they're encrypted? Mobile device management helps you have the peace of mind to know that your corporate and company devices are all set up and your data is safe. Mobile device management helps provide a standardized experience across all devices, whether that's the right apps in the right place, whether those are the apps that you don't want that disappear, or even a wallpaper that is company branded. So that way when you're facing your customers and they see your company owned iPad, 
as they're signing a work order or arriving at the destination. Uh, it's, it's a message and a brand tool uh, for your reputation. And there are tools in order to help organizations find devices when they get lost. There's so many different functionalities and tools that we can talk about, but I hope that this is helpful to begin to lay the framework of what mobile device management does. But what a better way uh, to help explain what mobile device management is than to hear from our customer today, Preventive Pest Control. Chris Lundeen, he is the manager out of the Tennessee uh, Preventive Pest Control um, office. And uh, they had been deploying iPads and iPhones and giving those to their employees. Well, after a couple of years of supporting those workflows or providing the technology, they issued their employees over the years. And as we grew, as the company grew, it became a lot to manage from a manual standpoint. They decided to do an audit and then they realized that they had a lot of devices that they had no idea where they were. They were either lost or stolen over the years. And when he began to see that that physical investment of a technology was missing, he said, hey, that was the wake up call I needed. I decided to get on board with an MDM and reached out to Jamf. Now you might say, hey, I already have an MDM. I'm, I'm able to solve those problems. Jamf is an Apple-focused platform in order to help you be successful. We know Apple in and out, and we have since day one, even before iOS was even a thing. We're here to help you from a same-day support. So that means that the new software and security features that Apple continues to push out year by year, month by month, we're able to support that so that you know that your employees can take advantage of all the new functionality as well as keep those devices secure with every security patch. If you have more questions about Jamf, we'd love to talk through that with you. Uh, and uh, we can answer some of those questions as well throughout the end. But as we move forward, we begin to think about, hey, what does the journey of a device look like? What can we expect from somebody that's turning on their device for the first time? Does it go to one user? Does it stay with them their entire time at your company? Is it a shared device? So there's a bank of iPads or iPhones that a driver or a, a worker needs to pick up at the beginning of their shift. What if it's a manager versus a handler uh, unloading deliveries off the truck? And then what does refresh look like? How do we help you be successful, not only with setting up your devices, but also resetting them and then resetting them up as well? And that's where we talk a little bit about user-initiated safety through our applications that we've developed called Jamf Setup and Jamf Reset. Now, these are free apps in the App Store that are completely customizable for you to take advantage of to support your shift workers, your uh, shared devices, so that when a driver grabs their device with just a tap of their finger, they could quickly and easily set up or reset their device. Let's take a look. So when a driver maybe picks up their device before they start their shift or before they start the truck, they can go into the Jamf setup application, select the customizable function that says driving, and then the device automatically hides the apps that the driver doesn't need throughout their drive. Maybe you want them to have maps or dispatch or other solutions in order to help them be successful. But then when they arrive or they're done with their shift, they can easily go back into Jamf setup, select not driving, and then you know the rest of the apps that they might need for personal use as well as business are available for them to use. This can really help organizations create the right behavior for your employees without a large lift from IT. Empower your end user with the technology that allows them to be successful with their deployments. Or maybe you have different roles within an organization, and so you need to be able to provide a role-based setup for your iPads. As you can see here, you can have an iPad have different configurations based upon who is grabbing this device. Whether it's a manager, a delivery driver, or an office admin, they can grab any iPad, 
select their role, and they're set up and ready to go. And while you're out on the field or on the work site, if there's a problem with a device, uh, those in IT, we know that sometimes we just need to reset this device. We need to set it up just as easily as it was set up in the first place. And Jamf, we're really good at not only deploying devices, but also redeploying devices. So using the big red button called Jamf Reset, a user can go in, select, I'm going to factory reset this device, set it back up. Yes, I'm sure I really want to erase this device. And then of course, you know, go through the setup. Now you can know that this is actually a successful workflow for organizations because when a device gets set up and it's utilizing Apple Business Manager and Apple services, which are free by the way, can actually be reset up with the right apps in the right place for the right user, all without IT needing to say anything, without them needing to touch the physical device. So we've kind of laid the groundwork. What is mobile device management? Building upon that of user-initiated safety workflows with Jamf setup and Jamf reset. And now for the icing on the cake. For those of you who need to automate your safety workflows triggered by various contexts, the car starts, I'm around a forklift, I'm in a specific zone. That's where we found a great partnership with True Software. We've been working with them over the last year to create a workflow that's reliable, that's consistent and expected so that no matter what context your driver, your employee is in, you can know that they have the right app for the right person at the right time. And so with that, I'm going to hand it off to Pete Plodas, who's been uh, so graciously waiting, and uh, he'll share a little bit more about what Jamf and Truce are doing in order to help you automate employee safety with Apple device management. Pete? Thank you. Hi, my name is Pete Plotas, and I'm with Truce Software. And I wanted to talk with you a little bit about Jamf Worker Safety powered by Truce and how it's applicable for your business. When we think about mobility, we think about it as an enabling factor to getting the job done. And when we look at the industries that this applies to, we think about those industries that have an elevated level of inherent risk with workers that are out in the field getting the job done, not in an office. The deskless workers that re rely on mobility to get their work done. And so when we think about this, utilities comes to mind, construction, warehousing, logistics, and a variety of other sectors that this applies to. So in all those cases, the worker, the employee, needs their mobile devices to be accessible, to be intelligent, to be adaptable, and to provide them with the access to the right applications and features and functions at the right time. They need it to be an inherently intuitive experience. However, the business, your organization, needs that mobility to be provided in a way that is in an enforcement of your policies and in the compliance to your policies so that the employee experience is both productive and safe. And the net result is managed risk, reduced liabilities for the business, and a safe and productive work environment for the worker. So Truce offers this automated safety layer that sits on top of Jamf. This automated safety layer enables your mobile devices to be managed in a way that allows for dynamically changing intelligent enforcement of your policies to provide that right access to those employees. That is what automated safety is. And that is the integration between Truce and Jamf Pro. So automated safety is an enablement of a dynamically changing user profile that understands through context who the employee is, where they are, what's going on around them, and a variety of other inputs, using those pieces of context to serve up the right access to that right person at the right time. It provides them with a personalized user experience. That's important because it also removes all of the other things that they don't need access to that may also be in violation of your corporate use policies. And so 
all the while providing a productive and intelligent mobile use experience, and at the same time, giving them the safety and removing the distractions. So let's have a look at what this looks like in practice. Truce integrates with Jamf Pro to create a seamless iPhone and iPad experience. When a user is not in a Truce protected zone, they have full access to their mobile device. Once the user enters a protected zone, the Truce experience is streamlined. Truce informs Jamf Pro to automatically hide all non-approved apps. An optional alert can let the user know that they're now in a Truce protected zone, in this case, a vehicle zone. The current zone information also appears on the device's lock screen. To use an allowed application while in a Truce protected zone, simply tap on the app. Truce and Jamf Pro ensure the right applications are available at the right time, based on company policy. In the vehicle zone, this user currently has access to maps, music, and podcasts. If the user moves into a new zone, like a warehouse, they can access a different set of allowed applications. Once the user is no longer in a Truce protected zone, they have full access to their mobile device again. That's the Truce and Jamf Pro experience on iPhone and iPad. All right, so what we saw is the ability for us to really combine very innovative and very proven and scalable technology in Jamf MDM powered by Truce Automated Safety to provide an environment across your workplace that supports the needs of your employees to get the job done. We saw examples in the video where vehicle and behind the wheel use cases might apply in the cases of your field services staff, or if you are running a vehicle fleet of some kind, or you're in a last mile delivery business, or perhaps the logistics arm to your company. There are also other use cases, such as in and around heavy equipment. Those apply to utilities and construction scenarios, or telco and cable, or mass transport. Thinking of those scenarios where people are operating heavy equipment, where you need to have focus and productivity and safety, as well as for the people that are around those pieces of equipment. And then lastly, on-premises. And those apply to warehousing sides of your business, to a factory floor, a manufacturing facility, or even a work site like a construction zone. So in the end, the way we'd like to ask you to think about this is that Truce is this automated safety layer that extends the power of MDM by enabling this very native and natural user experience that lives in the background, that just naturally provides your company's policy automatically so that your employees have the right experience that you'd like them to have to be productive and safe at work. Truce is an iOS native based application that has many patents that are focused on getting the most out of the iOS platform, including the way that it handles hands-free talk, notifications management, text handling, and many other things. Truce is built for scale. Over 400 companies, large and small, with 130,000 users, trust Truce with their employees' mobile safety and productivity. It's an enabler to driving a successful mobile program that is also focused on user privacy. The solution doesn't track anybody's usage of the mobile device, browsing history, application access, photos, or anything like that. It simply brings your corporate use policies to life in a way that allows for access to be in compliance with your use policies and in compliance with the work that's being done at hand. Awesome. Yeah, thanks so much, Pete, for taking some time to share with us a little bit more about how Truce and Jamf work together in order to keep employees safe in whatever context they're in, while also creating a great experience for the end user. Now, a story is never complete without a storyteller, without somebody who's in real life using this. And so, of course, we're going to highlight our partner, our friend, our customer, uh, preventive pest control. Chris Lundin shared with us some additional quotes that we'd like to share with you today. Now, when Chris was specifically looking at driver safety, they chose to move forward with Truce 
when they saw an increase in avoidable accidents. Now, I love alliterations, and so this just like got my heart going. Avoidable accidents related to our drivers being distracted by cell phones. Do you have avoidable accidents in your organization? Chris did. And so he partnered with Truce to, uh, to maybe help solve this problem. And he shares that he loved that Truce gave them the ability to limit what drivers can and can't do on their cell phones when they're in a work truck. No other context. When they're out of the work truck, they can do what they need to do. But when they're behind their, the wheel of their car, they wanted to be able to remove what the cell phone could do because it's more important that their employees stayed safe than anything else. So Preventive Pest Control shared with us a little bit about their story. They were managing company devices uh, and, and having trouble with those devices and deploying the Truce app. Their goal was to streamline deployment to make it simple for phones to get out. They wanted to use a corporate devices that they could manage and secure. They also wanted to reduce avoidable accidents caused by distracted driving. And their solution uh, came together with Jamf and Truce. With Jamf and Truce, they were able to deploy and configure corporate-owned iPhones, in their case iPhones, to restrict device usage while behind the wheel. Here's what Chris had specifically to say about it. Now with Jamf, Truce was a seamless integration that went smoothly and extremely fast. Now the Truce application is on the phone, ready to go before the employee is even issued the phone. And we like to call that almost magic. How does that even happen? Well, when the tools come together with Jamf and Truce, you can see that it can be a very successful deployment in order to keep your employees safe. We're helping you drive and empower the purpose-driven device experience. What does the device need to do and what does it not need to do in various contexts throughout the day. A natural uh, consequence of that is protecting your organization from liability. It was fun talking to Chris a little bit more about his story because I asked him, I said, hey, what do you think about you know, the impact of driver safety has been on your organization? And uh, without saying anything else, he, he shared, uh, he said, if, if I could put a number to it, I've probably seen a 50% reduction in avoidable accidents. What does that mean for your organization? What if Jamf plus Truce could work together to support you in reducing avoidable accidents and saving your company from that liability? But more importantly than all of that, of course, we want to keep workers safe throughout their shift. We want to send them home in the same way that they came to work that day. Now, as we wrap up our time, we hope that this has been helpful for you. Thank you so much for engaging through the chat. Uh, and we'll be answering those questions here in a moment. If you do need additional resources or uh, you, know, you have questions about you're currently using Jamf or you're currently using Truce, or you wanna learn more about the whole platform experience, we have a varied level of support, additional training and professional services to make sure that your deployment of devices and Truce are successful, streamlined and simple. Our partnership with Truce, you can find on our marketplace at marketplace.jamp.com to learn more. If you have other uh, tools that you use within your organization and you want to see if they integrate with Jamf as well, feel free to search that out or reach out to us as well. We'd be more than willing to help you. And those of you that are understand what an API is and, and know that acronym, uh, we do have a developer reporter as well to help you create a solution that's unique for your organization and create workflows that help you be successful. So we encourage you to take advantage of our community, whether that is the marketplace, whether that is the developer portal, Jamf Nation. It's a free uh, solution for you to join in among other Apple admins, educators, uh, safety personnel, leaders, in order to help you be successful with Apple in your workplace. Thank you again for taking time out of your day, joining another webinar 
listening to us talk and share about something that we're extremely passionate about. If you have questions or you're ready to get started with Jamf, feel free to open up the camera app on your iPhone and scan the QR code you see on the screen. It will direct you to our worker safety landing page where then you can reach out to ask more questions specifically uh, that you might have for your organization. Of course, you can also email us at info at and we'll support you with whatever questions you might have. So thank you again, everyone. Uh, we appreciate you taking the time to join us. Take care.